what is up guys welcome back to another video today i'm over here coming to rancho la soledad it's been a long time i filmed over here came to see jose my friend uh because he's gonna uh weld my uh mud flaps my mud flaps had uh oh shit my wipers are on so yeah my, he's gonna weld my mud flaps yeah i've been needing some pieces that i need to get welded because my mud flaps the last time i was uh in indiana when i was coming back in uh barstow um they uh they broke so i had them in the back of my truck that was a while that was probably, probably like two three months ago or more than that i think that was like in october the last time i was out there so yeah <clears throat> i gotta fix that because i need them because i don't want to get in trouble for them because when i tow in case i like pick up a metal or something or a rock it doesn't either damage the trailer or it doesn't damage a car behind me so yeah so i'm pulling up right here to rancho la soledad i wonder where jose is at i'll find out right now after we after i find them a ver what's the task today i came to fix my mud flaps not to fucking stables Pues ya que verdad, no tenía nada que hacer de todos modos. Ey, te la paso dormido. Dices que me la paso dormido en la casa, guys. ¿Será cierto? Sabe. Eso sí no sé. We're right here cleaning stables. We're gonna, we're gonna make a business, man. Yeah, we're gonna make a business. If you guys wanna hit us up to clean stables, aquí estamos. We'll go to your guys' house. What are we gonna call it? Mobile stock cleaners or what? <laughs> <laughs> nah, but we're right here, guys. Right now, once we're done cleaning these tables. Mobile sack of shit. Oh, que va a mobile sack of shit. Right here, now we're feeding the animals. So we're gonna move the tractor real quick. So yeah, now we can feed the animals. He's over there. I keep telling Jose every time I come, there's something new here. Like this. If you guys go back on the old videos, this was in here. Oh, damn. And then Nutella Muddy too, so. Got some little piggies here. Big mama. Big mama pig. I'm gonna pay you mad. I don't know what he's taking out. Got some more uh, pigs. Excuse me, more pigs over here. A little brown one.
I don't know what he said. What is that for them? <laughs> I have school right now. No saliste madreado, güey. ¿Qué es su pinche cereal para los pigs o what? Yeah, es garbanzo. What? Nicole, garbanzo. Oh, garbanzo. Yeah. Sé que es su. You gonna put that one inside too? Yeah. Oh, right. Got this. Traiga del año, porque sé que es caro chile. Oh. <laughs> Seca, eh. Se hey. ¿Eh? la plasma. Oh, 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 oh. He's, he's selling a TV. Hey, let's do a raffle. Y ser barata. ¿Cuánto ofrecen por ella? Viene hasta con ti tierra. <laughs> No manches, Jose. Got the water truck. Don't need water right now. See, let's see. Put it right there. More? Ahí está, no? Ahí está, wey. Mira. Yeah. You sure? Le podemos dar más, wey. No es que diga. <coughs> Ve cómo va aquí el pinche proyecto. <laughs> so these are my old muff flaps. Aquí valieron yonga. They broke from the thing right here. Mira. Damn. Pero they used... no se quebró la soldadura. No, eh, eh, sí. eso fue lo bueno. Eh? La soldadura estaba bien hecha. Mira. Sepa quién la hizo, pero. Shout out to whoever wanted that. They did a good job. Yep. So that's how my muff flaps used to be. But. I don't like them. Well, I did like them, but they're bented already. So, time for some new ones, huh? <laughs> oh, it's torcida because some lady, some lady uh, ran into me. 
that's what they are saying. No, I swear I have the pictures too. Su puta madre. Me dio un santo putazo. She ate my hitch though. We're gonna do some other ones, some new styles. And uh, keep going and see hopefully how these come out. Right now we're just trying to figure out the angle from here. Which we're pretty much getting it already. Jose right here getting down. But yeah guys. A ver que, a ver como se miran. Cuidado esta madre no se va a caer. Y te den los deditos. But yeah, if I need more material, I'll use the old one. My safety goggles? Where are your safety goggles? Put them on. Well guys, I've been slacking on finishing the video of the mud flaps, but my homie Joseph right here. The truck needed a detail, so I told him to uh, shoot through because it was it was filthy and since i just got back from uh utah um there was snow up there so uh yeah it just needed a wash so homie joseph right now he's getting down hit him up Double touch it. so you guys are his decal right now sheesh how long has since it been since when was the last time like two months ago <laughs> Yeah, bro. Or more? Two months ago. Like more, no? Follow him on Instagram. Hit him up, hit him up. Temple touches. So I'm going to show you guys some of the mud flaps. Well, the mud flaps, I had them already, fool. I just took them off so you could scrub the bumper. Okay. The mats are in here. Took off the mats because I needed to sand down the metal, the angle. I pre-painted it. I ran out of paint, so I have to go get some more uh, once he's done after washing the truck. But that's what the but that's what the the metal looks like. This goes inside of the hole. I'll show you guys once I put them back together. The same shape as my bumper. So it's gonna cover up like the chrome part and then I made them like the same length you guys will see I just didn't really record a lot of it but yeah, that's what that's what it looks from this side as you guys could probably tell if I, I sanded like all of it not the best but it doesn't have to be perfect for me I just want to paint it black it's gonna get full of um, dirt and debris and all that but I am gonna paint it black with some good paint like the rust and all that so guys yesterday it got dark quick after i had gotten ready and everything i was gonna show you guys the mud flaps but it was already dark but i had to come to madera 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 say like an accent i don't know if it's an accent but well as i was saying before some number called me randomly i don't know who it was but yeah i came to madera to deliver a trailer deliver this genesis genesis like new model camping trailer and to show you guys i also forgot i was gonna show you guys uh i was gonna show you guys what the truck looked after when it was washed after being like hella long Probably like three months since I have ever watched it but this is what it looks like probably already like filthy a little bit probably dust on it but it's tell right here on the tarp I don't know you can but and also when I went up to Utah I guess a rock or I don't know what the hell hit my uh, window they hit it like around right here. Yeah, it smells like top ramen. It smells like money. <laughs> <laughs> So I had to replace it 
and I had to retint this window and the passenger side window. So yeah, I didn't want the windows to uh, not having the same tint. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna match them and see what they look to the other one. But so far the back one looks a little darker than the front one, but this one is darker than the, than the previous one I had. Let's walk around this side. Lights, the lights are holding up. I also put the the silicone. I don't know if you guys can see it through here. Yeah, you can see. Put the silicone on the bottom. Right here. It went too up, but that doesn't matter. It's okay. That's just to prevent it from water, from water getting into it. Actually, water goes in them. So yeah, this is what the truck looks like after three months without a wash. Here's the clip. Gotta probably take it off and polish it. Have someone polish it. But yeah, it's already filthy. I have some extra black paint from what I oh shoot. I have some extra black paint from what I used on the mud flaps. So I might just hit this. It's to prevent rust. Damn. There was something stuck there. But yeah guys, let me show you guys the mud flaps. This is what they look like. I curved them to the shape of the bumper. Which in my opinion, they look 10 times better than what the other ones used to look like. The other ones would run straight across from here. And it was just like half of this. I'll see if I have a video of it. But yeah, those are the mud flaps guys. I did a bigger bolt on it. Had the nut welded through the through the bottom and then through the inside welded. And then I just put some screws to the inside out and then just cut them out and then sanded it. Other than that, I think I'm gonna put like some metals here, a bracket so this with the wind won't like bend. Cause if you see it and I let it go, they're called weights but yeah other than that it's better than better than the other one i like this one more better but yeah guys that's pretty much it nothing too fancy as long as it does the job sticker. i think i'm gonna take this sticker off but probably when i get home but yeah that's Pretty much it luckily um work's been picking up i've been doing some more runs but everything's still fucking expensive here so i'm just waiting they were checking the trailer already so i could leave they usually take like 10 minutes to check it and it's taking them forever damn look how fucking look how clean this thing looks like if you have a truck or a car and you don't sit here and just look at it and admire it, like I don't know what you're doing. But... I'm gonna show you guys inside this RV real quick. I'll pop off the slide out. Made by Genesis. I don't want to go out. But yeah, this is what they look like from the inside. With the fridge. Where's the opening oh, right here at the bottom? Freezer, TV, stereo. Bathroom. Bro, oh my. I I don't fit in this. Like, absolutely. I can't fit in one of these. I got a duck in every door. This is the bedroom. This thing always falls off when you're driving. I don't know why. 
slipped off. They probably didn't even put it right. This is a wannabe master bedroom. If I was to get one, look at me ducking. If I was to get one, I would have to get it custom made because I do not fit here. But yeah, that's one bed. I think that's two and that's three from what I know. Guys, just look at this. I can't tell you. To me, she looks sexy. I just don't know. I don't know why. It just looks so beautiful. There goes a dually. But yeah. Sheesh. Don't mind the, the fade paint. It's okay because she's a work truck. Uh, so yeah, guys. Now that I'm done rumbling about everything. Yeah, I pretty much did a little bit of everything in this video. Um, I helped out my friend Jose, the one that welded my uh mud flaps and helped me like cut them and bend them and all that uh but yeah it was it was a good it was a good um two days two three days i think it was like two days helping him out but yeah guys stay tuned for more content more videos coming your way and more bailes coming more soon tambien um, what else? Hopefully work picks up so I could go out of state to other events. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you guys are wondering, I still have patches. If you guys want patches, it's five bucks. It's a patch and two stickers. I'll probably put them on the screen. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. I see you guys subscribing. I appreciate it. It means a lot. And I'll make sure to bring you guys more good, more good content. Hopefully here soon. But... Yeah, guys, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.